You're soon to be off again, are you? Well, I have a few things among our supplies that may help you on your way. Perhaps a few extra arrows for your quiver, and a few of Solana's healing drafts may come in very handy as well. Take a look. Eridan, my friend. It's good to see you alive and well. I'll admit I wasn't certain we'd meet again, but then everything seemed grim after the Black Riders broke through our guard. It was days before I could shake off the feelings of despair. I'm glad to find you all still safe. How have things been here? Well enough. Quiet. We've seen no sign of the enemy since the attack. It's as if they have lost interest in us. Or perhaps we're beneath their notice now. But from the look of your gear, you've seen a thing or two since last we met. Are you in need of repairs? I found these materials amid old kingdom ruins. I believe they might be used to make a fine weapon. These are relics of our ancestors. Made in a time before the lore of Numenor dimmed. Hmm. If I had the use of a good smithy, maybe I could make something of worth from these. But not here in the field. If you're bound for Rivendell, you'll find skilled smiths among Elrond's folk. Try taking these to one of them. Are you hurt? You look well enough to me. If it's healing drafts you need, you can get them from Maradon. I have a dying man on my hands. Young Elrond is dying? But why? What's wrong with him? Wrong? I don't really know. His wound is minor, yet his life is slipping away. I fear he is suffering from the Black... The Black Breath? What is that? It is some power wielded by the Black Riders, the Nine Nazgul. Their victims are stricken senseless, and without aid, they soon die. I've already lost three men to this curse. Eleron is the only victim who yet lives. But there is still hope. What can we do? Uh, I hardly know. Drawing an arrow, stitching a wound. These things I have done countless times. The Black Breath is something I know only from the old rhymes my teacher taught me. Tell me this rhyme. Maybe there's some clue there. It was years ago. Let me think. I believe it ran something like this. When the black breath blows, and death's shadow grows, and all lights pass, come a thalus, come a thalus, life to the dying. What is this a thalus the rhyme speaks of? An herb. Commonly known as King's Foil, it has little medicinal use, though some find it comforting for headaches and other small complaints. Then there is no harm in trying it with Aleron. 
Do you have any of this Athelus? No, I have none. You'll have to forgive me for neglecting to lay up a supply. But you see, no one bothered to tell me that the Nine Ring Wraiths would rise up from ancient legends to trouble us here. If I had a Thalus, don't you think I would have used it? It must grow wild somewhere. I am willing to search for it. Perhaps you could find some at that. The plant is not native to Middle Earth. It was brought to these shores from lost Numenor and planted in the lands where our ancestors used to dwell, including the Borodans to the north. How will I know Athelus should I come across it? The plant has many long, smooth leaves, but you might best find it by its scent, a sweet, pungent fragrance. The Borodans hold precious few such plants. My road leads to the Borodans. Should I find a Thalus growing there, I will return with a supply. Downs are filled with ancient tombs. What do you know of them, Elf? These tombs were made by the fathers of men in the depths of time. They were sacred to the men of Arnor, and they too buried their dead here, until their kingdom fell to the Witch King. These hills have an evil reputation in the folklore of the Shire and Bree, but rangers travel here often without incident. Still, I feel a sense of unease. I must stay alert. Patrol? What manner of wretched creature is that? Servants of the enemy, beware!
Signs. A ranger has left a heavy cash here.